Hello friends, welcome to the world of recipes. I am Veshali and today I will be showing you how to make cucumber thalipit or cucumber paratha that too without rolling. This can be a breakfast dish. You can have it in your lunch or dinner. So quickly see the ingredients. 4 cucumbers medium size. Peach flour about 1 cup. Some spices. Red chilli powder 2 teaspoon. Turmeric powder half teaspoon. Salt about 3 teaspoon. Uh, cumin seed powder or jeera powder about 2 teaspoon ajwain or carom seeds about 1 teaspoon oil for roasting parathas or thalipit some water to make batter let's start with the recipe now first we need to shred this cucumber for that i just cut off the end and with this fine side I will shred it or break it. Now all these shredded cucumbers are ready. Cucumber has lots of moisture in it. This moisture will help us in binding the flour. Now let's add in all the spices. Red chilli powder and turmeric powder. Salt. cumin powder and this ajwain or carom seeds mix it properly now add in this wheat flour slowly Now this dough is ready you can either uh, add some more flour to this and make a tough dough and roll the parathas or the thalipit and roast it but we want to make uh, this thalipit without rolling so what i'm going to do i'm going to add some water to this because we need little thinner consistency here We are making batter with this mixture here, like a dosa batter or idli batter. Make sure there are no lumps here. Now, as you can see, this batter is ready. Now, let's roast our thali bit. Yeah, this tawa is heating. Now what I am going to do, I am going to take a handful of this batter, just place it on the tawa and take enough water in your hand and just spread it. And with the help of this water, you can make it as thin as possible. Give it a nice round shape. I usually make this uh, thalipit with my hands only. As you can see, the color has changed. This is the time when you need to flip it over. We need to separate it nicely from all the sides first. Carefully separate it from the tawa. And just flip it over in some oil on the top and let it roast from other side flip it over again and now put on oil from the other side Let it roast on high temperature. After about one minute of cooking from that, that side, you need to flip it over. And 
as you can see this is brown from this side but we need little darker color let it roast on the other side for one minute now this paratha is roasted from both the sides nicely now just take it out in the plate now we'll make second one now let's make one more take a handful of batter and just fry it take help of little water I always make this thali pit in this manner but you have to be very careful with your hand but if you are a beginner I will show you the other way how to so this paratha is also ready and let's just take it out now I will show you easy way to make it for the beginners take any flat bottom bowl or vessel whatever you have the small size just take handful of batter put it on the top put some water on it and just fry this with this It's also ready. Now serve it. I will show you one more way to do this. Take some batter. This is little thicker. Need to add some water in this. make it thin up very watery consistency and just spread it over and just spread with a spoon I have shown you three different ways of making this thali pit. It works well with all the ways. It will be same. Follow any one procedure that you are comfortable in. And this thali pit also ready. Let's serve it. All our thali pits are ready. Serve them hot with any kind of pickle or green hot chutney or spicy chutney. I hope you like this uh, quick and easy recipe of cucumber thalipit of paratha. You can have it for your lunch, dinner or even for breakfast. It is be best served with any kind of spicy pickles or spicy chutneys, red chutney or green chutney or you can eat it as it is. Thanks for watching this video. For more recipes keep on watching World of Recipes. Thank you.